Good morning and have a nice day. We are enjoying the world of adjectives. We have learnt a lot about adjectives. That adjectives are describing words. They describe nouns and pronouns. And now the question is that what is the correct order of adjectives in our sentence? So I am here to tell you about the correct order of adjectives in a sentence. It's royal order of adjectives. And the order is D stands for determiner, O stands for opinion, S for size, A for age, S for shape, C for color, O for origin, M for material and P for purpose. It's the correct royal order for adjectives. So let's start. First one is determiner. We have to inform if the adjective is singular or plural, definite or indefinite, next or far. An apple. It means the quanti quantity of apple is one. The book. Means we are specifying the book. The flower. A car. Means singular car. This. Means near. That woman. Far. Those teachers. These computers. Okay. The words and the, this, that, those, these. All these are determiners. Then comes opinion or observation. Okay. Now uh, we have to explain that what we think about something. Our thinking. It can be correct or incorrect. It's an other question. But what are we thinking about a thing? We are taking it as a beautiful thing, nice thing, difficult, horrible, silly. Okay, what's our opinion about that particular thing? Then comes size. Okay, we have to tell that either the thing is big or small. And if we say it's a big thing, we are telling the size. And what words are used? Large, enormous, tiny, little, minute. These are the words or such type of words are used to describe about the size. Age. Then we have to tell about the age. Either the thing, the noun is young or old. Okay. Ancient, old, young, new, modern. These are the words that we use to show the age of any noun or pronoun. Shape. Then we have to describe the shape of something. Either it's square, it's pyramid, it's flat, it's round, it's sphere or it's rectangular. We have to describe the shape of the thing. Then comes color. Okay, we define the color of the thing. How? Either it's red, it's yellow, it's green, it's purple, it's violet. What's color what's the color of the thing then origin okay where something comes from is it eastern is it french is it korean it's latin or greek or japanese okay we have to tell about it then we describe the material of something for example is it wooden is it cotton is it metal is it paper or is it plastic okay we have to mention the material of that very thing we are going to describe next comes purpose describes that something is used for okay we we tell for what purpose we are going to use this thing these adjectives of one and with ing for example sleeping bag frying pan cooking pot talking doll or punching bag and then comes the noun, the figure that is receiving all these adjectives. And uh, what can it be? Principal, teacher, crush, classmate, building, cell phone, etc., etc. Let's have a look. Determiner, opinion, size, age, shape, then color, then origin, then material, then purpose, and then noun and it's a table for the correct order of adjectives.
okay you can select a noun then you can think the adjectives about this noun and then for the correct order of these adjectives you can keep these adjectives in this table and then your sentence would be correct grammatically so you have to learn this correct order you can learn it by do says comp d o s a s c o m p okay you can there are nine types of adjectives that are usually put in the following order you can use you can memorize this order by d o s a s c o m p do says comp okay there are some exercises a beautiful table now the word is wooden and round where we have to keep it a beautiful round wooden table it will be the correct answer an unusual ring an unusual gold ring okay where we have to put the gold a new jacket and now we have to add nice where will it come a nice new jacket because nice is an opinion an old house and beautiful okay we have to add beautiful in this sentence okay beautiful is also an opinion and we will write a beautiful old house then black glove leather where will we put leather black leather glove okay now it's your turn sugar blue round bowl you will make the correct order of these adjectives and then there are some other exercises for you okay what will you do this one this one this one and this one you will read these exercises and you will send me the answers okay have a nice day goodbye